Hello everybody and welcome back to Morphine Folio. Today, who am I gonna play as? I haven't played as Zack in a little while. The Punished is always fun, but do you know what? Do you know what? Let's do a classic deleted run. They're always an absolute hoot um, and can, can cause some really crazy shenanigans, so why the hell not? Um, we are gonna go unlock, become a pirate, what the hell? Um, we don't want that, we wanna go back to Happy 99. Hazard, the regular old classic deleted. I'm feeling a deleted run today, just because I'm feeling like sowing some chaos. Also, I currently have um, Ipecac disabled um, and Job disabled, just because they're causing some errors and it could be messing with other mods, which does mean generally just maybe a little bit less lag, which might make the deleted a little more palatable. Uh, can you stop spawning things? Damn, dude. Oh my god, so many spiders. You need to chill the hell out, my guy. Chill the hell out. As do you. Um, each boss kill, 25% chance to spawn four throwable bombs. Every kill, 8% chance to spawn five random chests. Instead of dying once, use three pills. Every 70 seconds, 3% chance to spawn 12 random monsters. That seems horrific, but I'm going to do it. Mainly because of the chests thing. Every so many kills, we get like a bunch of chests. There you go. Or uh, it's a percent chance or whatever. Um, I think that's going to be pretty OP. It's, they seem to just be normal chests. But I don't know if they can be of any variety. Uh, but the random monster things will almost certainly be my demise. But I have committed now. Um, and I will stick to what I have committed to. It is terrible, but beautiful. So, as for today's question of the day. What are we looking at for today's question of the day? Oh, there you go. Okay, we can get any chest. That's nice to know. Um, what's something that you have given up on that you never thought you would? Because I, I feel like that's always a thing where when you're younger or like, I don't know, just when you're in a better place, you uh, you have goals. And sometimes they just don't work out. Sometimes that's just how life is. Um, and it's something that you thought you'd always stick at and... You didn't. For me, um, it was it's kind of a good thing and a bad thing. Um oh shit. Stitches, okay. Um for me it was um coding. I uh, I went to university for coding after like go doing IT at college and stuff. And yeah, I originally really, really enjoyed it. And I thought it'd be something that I really stuck at and got really good at. Um and and a lot of money uh, from in a job, but I ended up not um, not doing coding pretty much at all uh, after finishing university, just because I realized after going to university, oh my god, goddamn spike chests! I realized it just wasn't for me. Um, like I think that happens sometimes, where you do. Um, okay, let's take out this guy first. You, you end up doing something in education that you think you really like, but then when you get sort of forced to do it because of the uh, route education takes you, it kind of changes your perspective on things. And yeah, it ended up being something that I didn't think I'd, uh, I'd um, like quit. I, did, I thought I'd stick with it for a really long time and I ended up giving up on it. And I'm, I'm pretty glad that I did, to be honest. Like, it sounds pretty bad, um, but I, I, I just realized that it really wasn't for me in a working environment. Uh, cracked it in for me. I think we're going to go with this. Um... We lose one penny when we bit flip on Stitch. Get Steam sale until the end of the floor. That's not that good, to be honest. I'm just, I'm just gonna leave that. In fact, can I re-roll it? There you go. Shop price reduced by one. That's that's pretty decent. We'll take that. <laughs> Might be able to get something good out of that. Um, yeah, and um, I ended up sort of going into the stuff around coding, where I don't particularly do the coding myself, but I'm part of like a tech company, and I work with developers, and I like it this way. I think it's better. Um, I, as I've said previously, I'm definitely more of a people person than I thought I was, It's which is really strange, considering I, I consider myself a pretty heavy introvert. Like, I'm very introverted, but... Um, I feel like that's such a common misconception with introverts versus extroverts anyways, where people think that if you're introverted, you just don't like people at all. But that's really not what it is for me. It's more so that I just need my alone time. But considering I work at home, pretty much all of my time is alone time. So it's, it's quite nice. Uh, I, I get to be pretty sociable and talk to a lot of people. But at the same time... Um, I get to have my alone time. It's, it's really nice. Oh, dude, what have I done here? There you go. Stitches came in clutch there. That's pretty good as well. I'm going to bit flip it regardless, though. Every kill, 6% chance to spawn a shady. Um, 
That's actually not very good. Unfortunately, that has uh, bricked that item for us. I'm not very happy about that, but hey, her. Yeah, the the, uh, the telefragging damage you get with stitches is actually kind of amazing. Really? that You avoided that somehow? Wow. Oh, we got throwable bombs. 25% chance to get throwable bombs and killing a boss. Forgot about that. Golden Flakes. It could give us something good. I'm going to try it out. You see? Do you see? It gave us something pretty amazing. Um, pretty amazing indeed. Right. Let's carry on. We haven't got anything too glitched yet. Haven't got anything too crazy. But the, the chests thing could be nice. We still haven't seen the 12, uh, the 12 enemy spawns, which I'm honestly kind of uh, dreading. Because I think that's going to be pretty painful. But right now we're just happy with the fact that we're getting chests here and there. They are actually providing us with a very good amount of stuff. Um, and if, eventually, I'm hoping we get a good amount of items from this too. It really depends how many uh, enemies we end up killing. If we find one of those sack spiders, that's going to be crazy. Because they, they they spawn like 100 enemies that we can kill. Ooh, what the hell happened then? Dude, this enemy needs to die. Fucking god damn. That took forever. Um, he was... Why isn't that opening? Oh, dude, you got Cricket's head. Tricky bastard. Um, I was like, why isn't this opening? I've got to press the button first. There you go. Beautiful. Honestly, having this morbid heart right now is super clutch. <laughs> We're very low on HP, but it's, it's, it's somewhat working out. And then we do have a golden key, so we'll see what we can get out of this. Soul heart's really nice. The lens is pretty good. Uh, two range damage, taking damage. Okay, that's pretty decent. I think I'll take that. And we'll go. We need to take some more regular items before we start corrupting everything. Just to get a good baseline going, I think. Kind of like we did with stitches. I think taking stitches as is. What? But why did I stand like that? I need to start taking pills as well, considering we're getting so many of them. Just to kind of learn what's what. Because these brown chests always spawn a lot of pills. That's pretty good. Uh, oh, right. It actually swapped our golden key into a golden bomb. I don't think I've ever actually witnessed that before. Okay, this is a good room for spawning chests. Come on, little dudes. Just die. Unfortunately, only one chest so far. Dude, these things are so annoying to hit. Wow. I never realized how frustrating they were to hit. Unfortunately, we only got one set of chests there. I was hoping for a lot more than that, but I shall not complain. We need to go make our way over to our shop as well here, because uh, I think our shop could be pretty valuable for us. We've got a tiny dude here, too. Boom. <laughs> the telefragging. It's just too good. It's just too good. It also helps us with stuff like this. No thank you, big troll bomb. I do not want... I do not accept your offer. That, that is where it really comes in clutch. Stitches, just boop. Telefrag. Directly on top of the strongest enemy in the room. And then sort of continue with that idea. That's the way to do it. I think we start off every room like that if we can remember to. Mysterious Liquid, a very, very good item. Um, I think what we want to do here is um, we want to just... Ooh, hello. Uh, let's first of all bit flip both of these. Every six, whatever, poops. Every two minutes. Okay, that's, that, they're both, that's pretty bad. On Penny, use Molten Dime. Ooh. Um. That seems hilariously awful, so I'm going to take it. Oh, there's our six enemies. There's our multitude of random enemies. I thought it was on killing an enemy. It must be on taking an item, which is better, definitely. Oh, God. Oh my fucking life, what's going on? <laughs> Goodness gracious, that's going to be confusing. Balls. Okay, we need to be really careful here. Also, I don't know if I can kill this guy.
Right, I cannot pick, put, pick up pennies unless I have the health to do it. Which is going to make things certainly more difficult for us. Certainly more difficult indeed. Um, <laughs> yeah, the molten dime usage thing. We're going to need more health to make that work. Tears down, lovely. Speed up, though. Two speed ups. Ball to steel, awesome. Bombs are key. Bombs are key again. Good, good. What does the shop hold for us? Cherry bomb. Or it holds... Get holy, holy light until hit. Um, that seems really good, yeah. What a, what a noise that was. What the hell? Um, no, we don't want that. Beautiful. Right. This is, Yeah, this is going to be crazy. So holy light is a good grab here. That's going to augment our damage in a particularly good way. Uh, where's my Where's my boy at? We should get a chest at least one in here. I think it's like a 7% chance on enemy kill. We need some more fire rate. We just lost some and it was pretty devastating to see. Oh, balls. I gotta remember I can't fucking pick up pennies. Picking up pennies is a disaster. Look down, lovely. Oh boy. Yeah, this is gonna be tragic. Oh, bollocks. Yeah, I gotta remember how deadly coins are right now. More speed up. Thank you for Lost Ghost. Do I try and duplicate it? I do. Okay, we got one duplication. Good. We need more health. Dude, can you die? Oh my goodness. Um, it's a lot of pills. I just want to I make sure I've got like all the pills identified. Um, double lemon party. Balls of steel. Good, good. Another puberty pill. Right. What are you bit flip into, my good gals? On active use. Oh no, we can't take that. That's terrible. Um, and then this one is every kill 3% chance to use that. We get rid of stitches for that, but I'm going to take it anyways. Damn it. Yeah, this is going to be a little crazy. This this whole uh, this whole molten dime thing is going to get pretty pretty crazy pretty fast. Another speed up pill. Wow. Speed up. School bag. Um. Spawn thirteen random chests. Okay. I placed a lot of those in not so good positions. I'll be honest. Fuck! This is just getting confusing. Right, Hungry Ghost. I'm gonna try it. Balls! I was so confident it'd work that time. I should never be confident in this. Oh my lord. We just- we have so much potential to spawn money. <laughs> <laughs> this is the current issue. Spawning money is so easy for us. How did that bomb get behind me then? What the fuck? Sometimes it doesn't duplicate everything, which is weird. Strange times. Strange times we're having here. Yeah, like, that, that chest didn't duplicate at all. I don't really get where the discrepancy is between what duplicates and what doesn't. It's pretty weird. I suppose it just is what it is. Really, you're going to move straight away? I'm just pretty much using bombs exclusively here because my tears are so bad. Really? I, I aim for the wrong one again. Right. 
You need to go, dude. There you go. Lemonhead. We do need tears, so I'm just going to take that as it is. Did we get back-to-back -back XL floors here? It looks like we did. So we've got another item room we haven't seen yet. Bombs are so good for killing bosses, my god. Latch key that can get bit flipped. Um, why not? I don't know what these chalices do, mind you. They could be just awful for me, but I've committed to it now. I have committed to it now. Lemon head, meet lemon party. I can't believe that did actually deals damage to them. I wasn't expecting that. Can I remember? What the, uh, puberty, good. Puberty. Puberty. Health down. We're not getting any balls of steels. I'm looking specifically for balls of steels. We got a one makes you small. That's a new pill to us. Damn, we don't have stitches anymore, so we can't get into the, uh, see, uh, curse room. Whoopsie. It's okay. Okay, so what we do is we bit flip and see what we can get. Yeah, that's not worth it. So then we try and duplicate. And then we bit flip and see what we can get. Something's wrong. If I could... Dude, I just want to see what the bloody item does. God damn. Get this fucking bad gas out of here. Um, On hit, spawn three cards. Um, Soul of Eden... That's not very good either, actually. Um, so we're going to try it again. Oh, there you go. And I actually think we take Mask of Infamy as it is. Um, get one Pretty Fly. Get one Wisp. So on three Golden Troll Bombs. Uh, no thanks as well. Ah, and then it all, it all goes away. I had to keep trying, though. You know that I did. Where's my uh, where's my good trinket gone? Oh, stitches. We got stitches back. We also accidentally got Anima Solar here. Uh, which I think is better than stitches, to be honest. So I'm going to do that. One damage. Every kill, 2% chance to spawn three half sacks. Why not? And then we got Data Miner over here. Delete this. Why not? Right, everything got confusing. I don't know where my um, where my crown went. I did have a crown at some point. It is very much gone now. Humbling bundle is great. We'll take that as is. We got a mega pill. Mega something's wrong. I love the voice. The voice line's like the best part about it. Right, back to the boss. Seems we have on-demand paws as well, which is pretty nice. And away we go. Okay. Things are getting really crazy. This is El Classico deleted run. Yeah, it, it locks them up and pauses at the same time. That's pretty good. Um... Rotten Heart. That's pretty bad, actually. Try and duplicate it. Damn. Not always working out for us right now. That's fine. I don't know if I can use these burn orbitals for damage. Unfortunately, I no longer have unlimited bombs to work with. My bombs are actually limited now. Okay. Don't think we're going to pick up any of those pennies right now. Bow. Hermit. Yeah, I'm just going to pop the hermit straight away. The shop could be really useful. Steam sale. Yeah. It was already half price, but why not? <laughs> oh, why did I shoot that guy straight away? Literally no point to shoot him. He's a creepy motherfucker. Oh, God. Bad room for this guy. <laughs> 
There you go. We got rid of him. Um, spawn two times tin uh, tainted rocks and get dunce cap until hit. Spawn four troll bombs after two hits. Three percent chance of three halves. Give it a go. Why not? Oh, ho, ho. I was hoping. I was hoping and praying that the dunce caps would stack, and they very much do. I won't have them for long, mind you. Why not? Right. Let's keep this going for now. This is a pretty awesome setup we got going on right here. Just if we get, I think if we get hit, we do lose the uh, lose this though. So we got to be prepared and aware for that eventuality. My God. Yep, there you go. All of our dunce caps go away. Now, I don't know if they're gone forever. Or if they're just gone until the next room. Or if they're just gone until the next floor. I think they're gone forever. But well, they weren't going to last forever anyways. That's fine. Fucking... Ah, oh, these enemies suck off. Not fuck off. Suck off. They're annoying little fuckers. And I... We're getting all the annoying ass enemies right now. Dude, stop with this. There you go. We're getting a lot of luck. I'll say that. Quite a lot of luck. Oh, holy light. I forgot we still had holy light. It's been so long since I've seen a holy light shot. Ow. <laughs> it's kind of crazy that, like, we see a bunch of stuff spawn, and we're like, ooh, get all excited, and it all just disappears. Ow, I didn't realize you could dash like that. What the hell? I lost so much health to you. Oh, fucker. Oh, my God. The amount of damage I've just taken is redonkulous. It's because I kept picking up pennies by accident. I don't want to pick up no more pennies. Unless I'm in a financially viable state to pick them up in. And by financially, I mean health viable. My finances are fine. It's my health that's fucked. Get me out of here. I don't want to do rooms that I don't have to do. Every time I accidentally pick up a penny, I kind of crap myself a little bit, I'll be honest. Give me chests or give me glory. There you go. We got the chests. I didn't mean to pick up a penny. Fuck. No! There was so much potential there. The game took it all away. Goddamn took it all away. Literally unlimited luck at this point. We're so much luck. This is bound to be good. <laughs> Not a fan of this room either. I wanted the golden bombs. They would have been so good for this boss fight. Ah, what the hell? He threw the brain right at me. It's okay, we got him. We are out of bomb bombs now, though, which I'm not very happy about. All of you die. I'll just take that for what it is. We need tears up. Pascal Candle. I don't know. Do I want Pascal Candle? Probably. It does give us a lot better fire rate. Let's take it. We're going we're to be getting hit a lot, so it's not particularly good. But if we can keep it going at least a little bit, that'd be nice. Okay, one moment, people. One moment. Okay, let's continue onwards. And no thank you. It's kind of weird not having it, like, be an absolute shit... I was just about to say, not having the first room be an absolute shit show. 
And I say that, and then all of a sudden, a ton of enemies spawn. Where's all my goddamn um, good pills? Where's my balls of steel at? So much opportunity for balls of steel, and I'm not seeing it. Oh, really? I get, I'm getting hit so much at the moment. Oh, I kind of forgot that Holy Light is cracked as shit with this amount of luck. That's 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 pretty beautiful, actually. Although, we only get Holy Light for, like, a little bit. We don't get it all the time, which is slightly sad. We need some more luck-based effects. Let's look out for those. Look out for those. Get it. Oh, bollocks. I hate that attack. That attack's so rare that you never expect it, or just a tail. <coughs> Sorry about that. I tried to pause, but I couldn't get it done in time. But yeah, like, he does that. It's such, such a rare attack that every time he uses it, it always gets me. That's very good. We'll try and buy that right now. Thank you. You already got a soul out of it. Again, this might be another one that scales with luck. If it does, it's pretty crazy. I'm actually going to take that. I really need HP right now. Yeah, the ring shots that do extra damage that give us soul hearts. They might be based on luck. I'm, I'm not 100% sure. I don't think they are. They don't look like they are. What's this weird orbital we've got around us right now? Is that like just a unique burn orbital? So many tears down. No balls of steel. Lots of the things here just cost zero. I like that. Um, each boss kill gets speed upon floor. Use that on seven. Yeah, no thank you. That is a very awful deal right there. Right, let's get out of the shop. I need to be using this a little more often. So I can reposition. God damn, we're up to 53 luck. Give us some more luck-based effects. It'd be nice if this um, this placard thing, the, the one that I just bought, where it spawns a shop on a room clear, was luck-based. In fact, I kind of, I'm kind of surprised it's not. Being able to get like a shop when you finish a room that's like increases with the amount of luck that you have would be kind of crazy. That's, maybe that's why, because just because it'd be too good. But that's that's what I was talking about right there. Um, on hit, spawn 20 reward plates, spawn 6 random chests. Ooh. That seems just awful, so I'm going to do it. Okay. That's a really good item that I'm going to take. This room has gotten a little insane. Bollocks. I've created like a minefield of um of coins. Definitely take that. And I think we bit flip this. Each shop get whatever that is, get two times penny rolls on Soul Heart. Lose Isaac's heart. Well I don't have Isaac's heart, so that's fine by me. Now duplicate it all. There's our reward plates. <clears throat> Press them all. Keep pressing them. Oh god, this is an endless cycle, isn't it? This is never going to stop, is it? I just keep getting hit and spawning more reward plates. I honestly don't even know what keeps hitting me. I just keep taking damage continuously. I don't really know how I'm still alive. Oh my goodness. Fuck me, this is... this is chaos. Get me down that hole right now. I have no idea where my health currently sits, but it will not be good. Holy fuck, I lost a lot of HP to that then. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that was uh, not great. 
But that is the, the fun of deleted, so... Also, we got this thing that turns enemies into poops with an insane amount of luck. So... That's going to be pretty good, because it does seem to be luck-based. Prank cookie is really good, I'll take it. Yeah, look how many things are turning into poop right now. I need more HP, game. You know I do. There's apparently a soul heart in the last room somewhere. Ah, it's just somewhere I can't get it. Fuck! I didn't mean to press that button! Oh my god. Yeah. I don't even know what was going on there. But I think I do have a revive. No, apparently not anymore. Wow. Well, that was an insane, insane end to that run. Uh, the reward plates really screwed us there. That last room, I just took a gamble and I knew it was going to be bad. But this time, it just kind of happened. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed that and I'll see you guys in the next one.